Hi traders, this is Forex Nelson. I'm back doing another live trade. Today's June the 1st, non-farm payroll, uh, which is at 8.30. It's, eight, it's almost 8 o'clock at the moment. I decided to take a trade based on the meter and uh, this uptrend on the pound-yen. Pound is strong, yen is weak. I got in. Uh, let's see, I got in at uh, 718, somewhere over here, right here. Got in on this candle, this, can, uh, this candle, my mistake, and it went up for a cycle. Right at the moment, I'm up 15 pips, or over $800, as you can see down at the bottom, pound yen for. Uh, six lots, my usual. I'm comfortable with doing that on this one account, live account of mine. So basically, uh, I'm definitely going to close this trade before 8.30, non-farm payroll comes out and this thing can spike up or down. So you must be aware of that. Here on Forex calendar, right here at 8.30, we got non-farm uh, payroll, unemployment rate, and average hourly earnings. This will not move the market fast and it can jump up and down. This is the strongest news every month, first Friday of each month. So you got to be aware of this. Exactly 8 o'clock right now and I'm definitely going to get out of the trade in about I'm hoping it's going to break the top here and give me a few more pips, but I will close the trade before the non-farm payroll. This is uh, like very important. Uh, my auto stop is 20 and 40. I have it set at that, 2 to 1. There's my stop right here and right there. It's actually right on the ADR high. I'm still expecting this to go up and I'm hoping it's going to go some more before the 830 mark. Over a thousand dollars at the moment. It's fluctuating. I'm hoping it's not going to do a pullback. I want it to continue to go up. Maybe another 10 pips would be nice. ADR is 149. It only went 131. So it still has room to go, which is about 22 pips. As I said, it's got room to go. Another good pair to have done would have been the Pound Aussie and the Pound New Zealand. Pound against these three. I took the Pound Yam. Yeah. Doesn't make any difference which one. You can even check the, uh, just curious at the moment. Let's see, Pound New Zealand, what happened with that? It's doing exactly the same thing. Would have got in right about here. It's more pips than what I got at the moment. That's That was 36. Go back to the pound yen. Let's see what that was. 20, 22. Pound yen, uh, pound New Zealand always does a little bit more. To me it looks like it's going to break the top. Could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure All you can do is put in the trade, put in your stop. I can adjust the stop, but I'm going to close the trade. Um, could be one minute from now. Just depends on what's happening over here. And I'm going to try to see if I can figure out what to do with the non farm payroll. I don't know about doing it before. I'll make that decision uh, 10 minutes before. Uh, before the uh, 8.30 mark. I need at least five minutes to make a decision. Anyhow, I'm going to put this on pause and I'll report back shortly. For Nelson, I'm back. I decided to close the trade as it's stalling out right here and I need a certain amount of time. I have to render this video. I have to put it up on YouTube and um, I have to uh, prepare uh, for the non-farm payroll. So that's why I terminated it and I'm glad I did because 
it could do a pullback and they'll be sitting around wondering what to do anyhow I ended up getting in right where this cursor is there's my 20 pip stop and I ended up getting 16 pips as I said many times 10 to 20 pips is is I'm happy with that everything above the 20 is a bonus for $888 as you can see down at the bottom so anyhow um, if you like the pip trigger uh, please get in touch with me and um, we can talk more about it I can help you to get it uh, look right below this video uh, there's a write-up uh, on the pip trigger uh, package and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my youtube channel have to cut this uh, off now as I gotta prepare for the non-farm payroll whether I'm going to be trading it before or after and we'll see how it goes okay till the next trade happy trading